There was a warning today from Federal Reserve Chairman Ben Bernanke. He says that the longer oil prices remain high, the more of a threat they are to the U.S. economy. Our Adrian Sapino caught up with some drivers to see how they're dealing with the rise in gas prices. Gas prices are up 17 cents since last week. Nearly every day it gets costlier to fill up. Some New Jerseyans have simply stopped driving as much. Twanda Hagen started carpooling with other moms. Me and a couple of people that live in the same area, so, you know, maybe two days out of the week they'll drive, two days out of the week I'll drive, you know, just trying to save money. Just, you know, back and forth to work, that's it. Pick up my kids from school. People are not only driving less, they are spending less on other items as gas takes a bigger bite out of their wallets. The Fed chairman spoke about it today. Higher gas prices take income out of the pockets of consumers and reduces their, their spending and their confidence. Uh, and so it can also be a, a problem for recovery. Will pain at the pump persist? Unfortunately, what's going on in Libya and in Egypt is uh, creating a lot of question marks for the market. And gas prices are driving up the cost of most other things. Everything that needs to be trucked from turnips to tube socks is rising. Those costs of, of distributing the goods from the warehouse to the supermarket, for example, uh, it's going to be reflected in food prices, and that's going to negatively impact the consumer. A crude awakening for drivers. High gas prices in a bad economy equals less driving. Adrian Sapino, Fox 5 News. Well, meantime, there is some good news for drivers who fill up their tanks in Suffolk County. A new law has gone into effect that will cut the county tax for fill-ups. The four and a half quarter percent tax will only be charged on the first three dollars of the price of a gallon of gasoline. Now, that translates into just a few cents per gallon, but in a county that has seen prices jump, an average of 76 cents in the past year, every little bit counts. AAA says that gas prices on Long Island currently average about 3.62 a gallon.